Welcome to the Aquaspresso Coffee Academy. Today we're going to be comparing the Jura Giga range versus the WMF 1200 range. So firstly in terms of aesthetics, both machines are good looking machines. Both have all the bells and whistles when it comes to looks wise. They have screens on them, they have backlights on all your drinks. So in terms of which one is better looking in this case, purely preference, some people say Giga, some people say WMF, you've got to choose unfortunately. Second thing is features. Now, if you're going to look at, go to the internet and look at the drink varieties, you're going to see the WMF has about 12 different drink options and the Giga has about 43 different drink options. So what can this Giga do that the WMF can't do? Now, the reality is it's not actually that much. So when they classify the drink differences or the drink specifications in the Giga, they call an espresso one item, they call two espressos a second item. Same as they call a ristretto, which is basically just a short espresso, a third item. And again, two ristrettos, a fourth item. So they're kind of calling a whole bunch of different drinks, which are very similar drinks and sometimes just duplicates an extra type of drink option. So for the most part, they can pretty much do the same thing. The one thing where the, where the WMF can do, which the Gigas and no, pretty much no other automatic machines can do, is hot chocolate, which is a great, great feature in a corporate or an office environment. So the WMF has a hopper for beans, and on top of that, a hopper for hot chocolate, which is very, very rare in any automatic machine case. Thirdly is in terms of size. Uh, again, both of you are made for mega, mega usage, and for that reason, both are made to be plumbed. Now the Giga has an option where you don't have to plumb it. So if you, have, if you want to put a large machine in an environment where there's no plumbing at all, the Giga can go no problem. WMF is not that easy to be put in that type of place. Both, however, have huge bean hoppers, so nothing to worry about there. Um, so size-wise, again, not much to choose between either one. Fourth thing is backup support. And one last thing about both these machines is both of these machines are sold in whatever country through, through dealers or specialist dealers. They're not, pr they're not really sold through retailers when you get to this size of machine. And because they're not sold through retailers, you, you typically have one-to-one -one support. So you buy it from the company and that company will repair your machine, your fix, fix your machine and service your machine. Whereas in the retailer case, you typically have to go through the whole long retailer process. But both these machines, none of that, quick service on both, quick turnaround time. So again, not much to choose between either one. I would have to say in South Africa though, there are a lot more jury dealers than WMF dealers. And it's probably about 10 to one. So wherever you are, you most like to be, to be able to be quicker service than, than in the WMF case. Lastly is price. And these machines are pretty much the same price no matter where you go around the world, except for in South Africa, where the Giga for some reason is about 15 to 20% less than the WMF. Because there's a huge price difference, that's a major, major point for jury in that case and that might be the one thing to tip it over on in terms of the, in favor of the Jura. But otherwise, pretty close machines, both great options for an office or a corporate. Hope that helps you. Good luck choosing.